Hello, welcome again. Right now we will look at Russia continued attack fails and loss of Russia so far in the war. We have seen from previous news that Putin has been punishing generals for their mistakes in the war, some being sucked and other arrested and this has been revealing how Russia is losing a grip in the war. On the other hand, let's see what Russian have for their president, Putin. It is suggestions that the Russia have had enough of war. Many Russian concertgoers furiously screamed out against the war at a concert in St. Petersburg, Russia. The crowd can be heard chanting in quat, fuck the war and quat, in unison. Their defiant display of opposition took place on Friday night, with the clip garnering thousands of responses online. North of Moscow, a tiny little town called Rusko Vysotskoy, there is particularly eye-catching building painted in giant letters in quat, peace to Ukraine, freedom to Russia, and quat. Dmitry Skorikin, who owns the shop, in bright red paint he's listed the names of Ukrainian towns that have been attacked by the Russian army, Mariupol, Buka, Kherson, Chernihiv, and many more. And quat, I thought this would be a good way of getting information out, and quat, Dmitry says. And quat, because for the first few weeks of the war our people didn't know what was happening. They thought that some kind of special operation was being conducted to remove drug addicts from the Ukrainian government. They didn't know that. Russia was shelling Ukrainian towns. And quat. Dmitry has even turned the roof of his shop into a giant yellow and blue Ukrainian flag. Suddenly, out comes a paint pot and brush and Dmitry adds more names. He also added in quat. Russians are being exposed to disinformation. They support the special military operation that they're being told about on TV. But people are starting to realize that what's really happening is a calamity. And quat. Sadly, Dmitry Skorikin knows that paint will not bring peace. From streets, another voice said, and quat. For those who believe that Putin's propaganda machine is achieving, listen to fans in St. Petersburg shouting, fuck the war. And quat. And quat. If Russian support for the war were as high as pollsters claim, stuff like this would not be happening, and quat. A third tweeted, while a final user concluded, and quat. Not many in Russia have the courage to protest individually, as it's a fascist police state, but in situations like this they feel they can express their opinion freely, and quat. See you in the next briefing. For more information like this, kindly subscribe and leave a comment below.